As a child, I disliked fall and winter because of how short the days were. But as I've gotten older, I've really learned to love these seasons more and more every year. I love the coziness winter can bring. The atmosphere you can create in your home with soft lighting, warm blankets, or a hot drink in your hand. Home is our sanctuary from the world, from the weather, and from the trials of life. And the feeling that a cozy home can bring, well, that's just one of my favorite things in this world. Regardless of if you live in a brand new model home or a 65 year old one bedroom apartment in serious need of some updates, you can make your home feel more cozy and you don't need a ton of money to do it. I have nine tips for you today on how you can achieve this. So grab your fluffiest blanket, grab your cup of tea, and without further ado, let's get into it. The very first thing I recommend doing if you want a cozier feeling home is upgrade your bedding. Our beds are usually where we spend about a third of our lives at least. So in my opinion, this is just such a great place to start and give extra love to. Especially in the winter, a great way to cozy up your bed is adding flannel sheets instead of your regular cotton, linen, or bamboo. They'll keep you extra warm, they're soft, they're wonderful, and adding these to your bed will have you feeling snug as a bug in a rug in no time. Another thing to cozy up your home as far as pure comfort goes is either invest in a better mattress or get a mattress topper to make your bed more comfortable. Personally, we have a Tempur-Pedic and it's so comfortable we will never go back but i do realize that that's a very large investment so you know a great thing to do if you are not ready for that kind of commitment is buy a mattress topper to make your bed more comfortable and more cozy to sleep in another way to cozy up the bed is to add layers and textures layering blankets or even fur over the bed makes it look super cozy and knitted pillows or even knitted blankets um, help with this as well. My next tip kind of goes hand in hand with what I just said but that is texturize and layer. This is a rule with interior decorators and designers when they are trying to create a cozy home atmosphere. Add textures and create layers using things like pillows, blankets, thick high quality curtains decorations even furniture in my opinion adding pillows and blankets are one of the fastest and easiest ways to make your home feel more cozy right off the bat and you can just really play around with how you want them to lay how you can layer them with blankets but it just gives the home a softer feel a more welcoming feel and a more cozy feel tip number three is to add rugs with plush preferably. Especially if you have a home with hardwood floors, these rugs are just going to really cozy it up, make it feel warmer, make it feel softer, more welcoming, all that good stuff. You can also layer rugs for an even cozier effect. Tip number four is to use soft lighting. Again, this is one of my favorite ways to create a cozy environment very quickly, very cheaply. This looks like candles, a fire in the hearth, hanging up string lights around your home, especially around the holidays, and soft lit lamps with warm colored bulbs opposed to fluorescent bulbs. The lighting can really set the mood, but think warm and not too bright. Tip number five is to choose warm wall colors, metals, and woods when you decorate your home. This doesn't have to look like a deep brown on the walls. You can choose a warm white opposed to a cool gray or cool white. There's so many options, but pay attention to undertones when you're choosing these colors and it will create a cozier effect. Tip number six is to add real ingredients. <laughs> Tip number six is to use real materials when you can, especially wood. This can look like wood accent walls, wooden beams across the ceiling, wooden cabinets, wooden mantles, wooden furniture and decorations. As much as you can, I would try to be careful with how much fake wood you incorporate into the home. I think it is more beautiful and um, you can really sense the difference when you have real pieces opposed to an Ikea dresser that is pretty much cardboard underneath and like a plastic wood grain painted top.
Now I know that it can be expensive, but it doesn't have to be. You can thrift things, you can thrift flip things, and mixing old furniture with new creates its own charm. But as a general rule, dark wood is going to give a cozier vibe, whereas light wood tends to feel more light and airy. Other real materials you can sprinkle in here and there is real leather, linen, stone, wool, and also real plants. Tip number seven is to incorporate seasonal decor. Normally we want our home to feel cozy in the colder months, so take advantage of the seasonal festivities and use them to cozy up your home. Christmas trees lit up with twinkly lights are a beautiful way to do this. Adding real pumpkins in the fall or hanging Christmas lights on your walls, mantles, etc. In my opinion, nothing says cozy better. Tip number eight goes beyond decorating, but in my opinion, it is one of the best ways to cozy up your home. And that is to use food and drinks. One of my favorite parts about the colder months is being able to cook and have hot drinks. This looks like making soups on the stove, sipping tea, hot cocoa, or coffee while curled up with a good book, baking bread especially, pies, cookies, you name it. When it's cold outside, especially when it's raining or snowing, and you're in the kitchen stirring your zuppa Tuscana, taking out your fresh baked bread, serving a delicious homemade meal is so comforting, really adds a cozy atmosphere to the house, and is just an irreplaceable feeling. And my final and possibly most important tip to transform your home into the coziest place you or I have ever been is to watch my video on how to make the most delicious chewy chocolate chip cookies you have ever had from scratch right here next because what's cozier than sitting by the roaring fire or in my case scented candle with a delicious fresh baked chocolate chip cookie in your hand I have no answer. Hit that subscribe button for more content around simpler living, biblical femininity, and the art of homemaking. And I will see you in my next one.